All right, uh, welcome back to the Good Morning Nigeria show. For those of you now, we don't deal with me from the beginning. I don't say we don't give on all the things where we promised on now. We just finished uh, um, an amazing in Skype interview with uh, Lamide, uh, the AKA Nino's Treasure. Now, based on say, okay, you've been having a small business, how can you thrive in times like this, seeing that uh, you're in an industry where it's not so recognized, but uh, you need to put things in place to thrive. And she don't give us some kind tips on how you feel do that one. I believe for those of you who watched it, uh, you must have taken notes down. Because myself, I take notes, you understand? Okay, so moving on, we have uh, an, um, uh, an, a next guest we're going to be talking to, and I told you guys that uh, earlier we're going to be talking about uh, uh, harnessing the, the, the newest ways of, uh, of finance, seeing that uh, Forex and uh, cryptocurrency is out there, and a lot of people don't know this exists. So we're going to be talking to uh, Afolabi Olatunji. He is uh, um, uh, a business development coach, and he's going to be talking to us about these things finally. And let's get if we know what it is about. Uh, welcome on the show, Mr. Afolabi. Good to have you here. Yeah, awesome, awesome. Uh, thank you for having me on this show this morning. What All a pri right. privilege uh, to, <laughs> to, to okay. be on the show. Okay, sir. So, so looking at the conversation, uh, the conversation is creating alternative source of income, you know, and that is why Forex might be the next uh, big thing, you know. So let's even start from uh, what, what is Forex? Because for people with this street, we don't know. So people think different things about making money online or online making money. Uh, you know, there's a lot of conversation that goes on there. So um, just in a few words, can you just let us know what Forex trading is about and uh, cryptocurrency and things like that? All right. Uh, let, me, let me take. Can, can I go ahead now? Yes, yes, please. Go ahead. All right. All right. Uh, I think quick one, you know, uh, I've been privileged to be on this same show. Uh, okay. You know, this was even physical time. I mean, physical appearance, yeah, like twice. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I've had the talk, you know, educating people on why uh, forests or the, you know, the financial market could be the alternative means for everyone. Mm. Uh, we didn't pray for coronavirus. At I mean, all. nobody knew this is coming. Mm -hmm. uh, but right now, uh, you can see that uh, people are really now looking at, uh, you know, exploring the uh, Internet to look at uh, home-based business. Mm -hmm. A friend of mine shared with me, uh, I think it was yesterday, he said, you know, the rate at which Nigerians are exploring Google to look to to to, to look into home-based business. I saw 186 percent, 186 percent, never been done before. Wow. I mean, so it means that a lot of people are scouting online to look at, uh, you know, how to uh, earn or take advantage of home-based business. Now, looking mm -hmm. at it as a, as an alternative means other than just a regular, uh, you know, a nine to five that yeah. people are involved in. You know, so, but now let's take it away. You know, these are the things we've been saying, uh, whether you like it or not, uh, you know, the, the financial market is the largest, most liquid financial uh, market in the entire world. And uh, people, banks, governments, individuals, you know, retail, you know, institution, everybody participates in this market. Mm. And, you know, they, they are taken from me. Why bank is, uh, you know, why everybody, whole world is being hit with the plague? of coronavirus. Mm -hmm. People are in the house trading, making good money for themselves. Mm -hmm. I mean, how about you uh, also sitting in the comfort of your home? Uh, right now, I've not even stepped out at all. I'm in my house, uh, you know, hoping to just go do one or two activities. Uh, but I've been on the system. Uh, I've been able to, you know, take advantage of the market this morning. Mm -hmm. And that is what it is. So uh, people have to look, people have to look at it and say, you know, it is that time I start giving it a thought. It is that time I start looking at, you know, participating in this market. Because mm -hmm. uh, the only thing you need to participate is the skills. So you need to, uh, you know, look for the right platform uh, that can help you to learn it. Matter of fact, some of them are free. They are online. Mm -hmm. But the truth is that uh, somebody say, uh, you know, say nothing is, you know, uh, uh, even in free time, even there's in nothing free time, is nothing free. is free. Yes. <laughs> nothing is free. So... Uh, we just have to be careful. Sometimes uh, in, in life, there's something that you'll be willing to give in order to get what you want. Yeah. So even if it's a platform where you're going to pay a little token uh, that will help you to learn that skill, I can tell you, you'll be extremely beyond your imagination. Mm. Uh, because I used to tell most people, uh, you say you don't have time. You don't have time for this. So my job has gotten me down. But right now, the game has changed. Mm -hmm. A lot of people 
are really diving into looking at online. In short, many people are learning how to trade forex and crypto market. Mm. You know, I, I over the time, in short, I, I now I specialize more on crypto trading because it, it's a, an extremely volatile mm -hmm. market, uh, but it's yet more rewarding. Uh, I can compare to the forest market. For me, okay. I, I've been I've been involved in this industry for over five years, you know. Wow. And I, I find I find pleasure. And, I, and what I do is that I also mentor people, I, I coach people, I train people. As at 3 30 a.m. this morning, I was still online training uh, some some gentlemen from South Africa, mm. you know, and on how to trade forest. You know, this this is this is what I do because mm. I know I'm not just doing it because I know I'm impacting. You see. If Nigeria, so we're looking at our population about, uh, you know, above 200, 200 million. million, yeah, above 200 million, yeah, it's, a, it's just one percent of Nigerians that is able to get this thing right. Mm. We're going to help this country, we're going to help to solidify the foreign reserve of this nation, you know, and government will start now, you know, looking at it and say, how can we empower our youth? How can we? empower our citizens. You see, the government is doing enough, mm -hmm. uh, but they, they're not going to help everybody. They, they will not be able to, you know, help everybody out mm -hmm. there, but we need to look at how to help ourselves. So in helping yourself, how about you just sacrificing the little time? You know, uh, it's so funny when we look at, when you tell people to come learn the skill set, uh, some people will say, you know, I, I don't have the time. Yeah. Have you forgotten the, the job you went to go so, you know, I mean, the, the, the school you went for, four mm -hmm. years program, five yes. years program, yes. sacrifice. At the end of it, you end up putting the certificate somewhere after school. Maybe the job you're doing is not what you're going to be earning money from. Mm -hmm. Now, I tell people, now, I, in Nigerians, if you are listening to me, let, let me tell you something. The world is not about certificate. It's not about certificate. It's about certificate. Hmm. Certificate. Mm -hmm. So, so, so now who's certificate? Nine they jump now. Now they bring the money. Mm. So so you need to learn that skill uh, to help you put money consistently into your pocket. I mean, there's nothing wrong. If I sacrifice three months of my time learning, you yeah. know, I, I'm able to pay my dues. Mm -hmm. Now I, I I have some gentlemen that uh, you know he send me a screenshot and I put it on all my on my social media. I share with friends. Mm -hmm. You know, this guy still works, okay? Uh, this is a guy that normally trek. He trek from, you know, from miles, even to even come and meet me and learn. Mm -hmm. And guess what? Share something with me a couple of days ago. And he, he, he said, sir, boss, I'm able to, you know, turn $19 into way over $480. Mm -hmm. Now, to me, nothing... You know, nothing touches me, nothing breaks my heart more. I mean, that guy touched something inside of me. And he said, apart from that, that he also took another account, which is about $35, mm -hmm. to about five sixty dollars mm. And he told me, he said, boss, I still work, but I will never be poor again. Mm. Because right now, every day, I can confidently do minimum of $100 daily. daily. Now, when I saw that, I, I pull up that and I say, oh, my God. I mean, you know, I wish Nigerians, I wish people can hear this. You know, and this is somebody that is still working. Mm -hmm. He still works as a job. He just but has right to create now, time. He has to create time. Now, he, he can he can, he can, can fire his boss to yeah. become a boss. Yeah. Because he's, <laughs> he can he fire. Has, what he's working for, he's probably, you know, making that on, uh, this, on, 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 on this platform. Hmm. That, absolutely. Absolutely. So, uh, you know, but if you look at the market, the market on a daily basis, as yes. I speak to you, yeah. uh, is generating over $6.6 .6 trillion every day. Wow. Every $6. day. $6.6 .6 trillion every day. Hmm. Guys, you know, that's what I say. You know, how are you going to watch the money? The only way you can tap into this, uh, you know, this, this liquidity is that you need a skill. True. You need a skill. You must know how and it's so done. Yes, and, and that's your skill set is what's going to help you to be able to learn before you can earn. Mm -hmm. uh, most times I tell people, if you look at the word learn, L-E-A-R-N, mm -hmm. you see, I tell people that it takes, it, it, if you close the first letter, L. L, yeah. What do you have, sir? You have earn. <laughs> All right. It means that you cannot earn Without learning. Without you learning. 
Mm. So that, that's the that's the secret to success. So but most of us we want to put you know the, the other one first the before we you know before we learn and, it. <laughs> yes, I, I don't really blame people. You know, some people are first victim of scam. You know, exactly. like give somebody my yeah. and all that. You know, I you was I was I was actually I'm, going to talk about that. Seeing that that has been. So they've been a rise in that. People say, okay, I sent money to this person, I didn't get to, you know. So people are really cautious of this aspect. And seeing that it is an online system, uh, you understand? You know, Nigerians, we like to see what we do physically. We like to hold something or, you know, see physical, uh, so, um, so. uh, you know, um, stuff. So being in in this space now and you've been there for quite some time and you've seen how it's going how have you been able to you know convince people or manage this aspect of distrust when it comes to being involved in forex trading okay i think uh, i would just say a simple you know word to this you see uh forest forest trading himself is about 80 percent of your patients hmm. 10% of your buy and 10% of your sell. You know, the activities we do basically is just buying and selling. Yeah. Folks, folks are not are not eager to 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 you know to stay put. Like we we just after the profit. We're yeah. not we, we just want our money. Wait you know, process. We, we don't we don't want to, no, you don't want to wait. Now, you know, the problem here is that let, let me share something powerful with you. You know, when somebody hears that you are trading, mm -hmm. uh People want to come to meet you and say, see, if you give you this morning uh, to help me trade, how much are you going to give me? Mm -hmm. Now, you, you're not looking at, you're not looking at the, the security, the risk part of it, mm -hmm. aspect of what you're going to. I, I've seen many people, even when you give millions of Naira to people to trade for you, uh, the guy will come back and say, you know what, you know, the money is blown up. So mm -hmm. what are you going to do about that? Yeah. Uh, you, you know, you, you say, man, but you promised me. Mm -hmm. It's not about promise. But when you tell the same person to come and sit down to learn how to become the manager of your own account, now it becomes difficult. Now, that person would say, oh, man, I don't have the time. You don't have the time, but you just fall victim of, of being duped. Now, you, you don't have the time. So when are you going to have the time? Maybe the work you're doing uh, will, will help you. You know, one of the things my mentor told me about success, and I'm going to give to everyone listening to me, mm. and ever since I heard that, uh, my mentor is just a 36 year old Nigerian American guy. Uh, he's, he's a multi billionaire in dollars, not Naira. Okay, so. Okay. Uh, yeah. So he, he, he says, he said, success is, first of all, your desire mm. plus your skills. Desire and skills. Times the faith. Mm. Yes, it means your desire mm -hmm. plus your skills times your faith hmm. equals success. Now, what does that mean? It means that you have to have the desire. You must be eager. You, you know, there's something that must arose from you. Maybe you, you have the desire as a result of your financial level, financial yeah. situation. You want to change it. Maybe you're, maybe you're tired of being bullied around your boss, bossing you around, you know, mm -hmm. people, you know. Maybe mm -hmm. you're tired of somebody telling you, to come and get lunch, uh, you know, when you are not even hungry. I say, you know, it's lunchtime. You know, they don't even ask your permission before telling you to go to lunch, you know. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you know it's, a, it's a long time, you know. No, so you have to have a desire for it. Mm -hmm. And the second one is that I need a skill. I mean, whatever you're doing, this principle works for everything mm -hmm, as true. far as you are looking at being now, you need to have a skill set. Where can I learn the skill set? Where can I get expertise? Where can I, you know, get the right knowledge to help me become really on top of my game in this field? Now, your faith, which is ultimately, is going to back it up with everything. Mm. You know, the way I define faith, I say faith is your belief without proof. Mm. You know, so you put these three together, my brother, you are well on the way. I can tell you success will be visiting. And you can apply the same principle into anything Anywhere. you do. You are gonna hmm. now one of the things coming back to same forest we're talking about and also at the crypto market. Hmm. Now the people need to understand that this is a market that runs 24 hours a day, five days a week. Okay, so it means that uh the, the market just started last night, 10 p.m. So on Friday again, the market will be shutting down by the same time, 10 p.m. Okay. Now the difference between the forest market and the crypto market is that you can actually trade in the forest market 
for uh, 24 hours a day, five days a week. Why crypto market? You can trade it 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I was in the crypto market. Mm -hmm. I'm a crypto enthusiast myself, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, you, you you make the money every single day if you have the right skill. Right. And maybe with the help of good platform. Uh, is going to help you, okay? So I, I don't know if this makes some sense. I don't know. Yeah, if, yeah, it does. Uh, it's, I'm, quite, I'm... It's, it's quite insightful. Uh, the, for me, I, I believe the final question I'll be asking is, why do we th why do we say that uh, the forex might be the next gold mine? You know, because that is a conversation that people are are saying and they are trying to pass that information out. So why do we think it's the next gold mine? Okay, as 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 we are seated in the house now, like mm. if it's not the next gold mine, bros, uh, six point six trillion dollars. Yes, that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. <laughs> there is no you can't even convert no, it to naira. <laughs> you, you can't. You can't. You know, it's it's going to be showing error, error, yeah, error, yeah. error. So what else do you call gold mine? What else do you call gold mine? Mm. Go, the, I mean, this is the biggest. Is the largest, most liquid financial market in mm. the world. Most liquid financial market in the world now let me tell you why is the next gold mine or why it has always been the the gold mine that people are not tapping into it has always been okay. it has always been leading okay now you know in the forest market you can even trade in gold you can trade gold you can trade stock mm. you, you can trade everything so it it accommodates everything now if you look at nigerian budget mm -hmm. i mean we are I don't know if it's almost 10, 10 trillion naira now or something, mm -hmm, or, mm -hmm. maybe, or maybe nine trillion naira. Yeah, about. Now, our yearly budget, you cannot put it side by side with what this market is doing on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. That's something to think about. We're talking about six point six trillion dollars. Remove one year money to run a country. Mm -hmm. Now, remove it in that one-day market, and you know that this market will not even feel anything up. It's just like you're putting a scoop in the ocean. Yeah. Now, so, what else do you call a gold mine? That is a gold mine. Hmm. That is where everybody, if it is not a gold mine, go ask the banks, the financial institutions. Mm -hmm. Now, you know what? It, they don't joke with that guy. Most of their money is coming out from the all the money. Most most of the money we all deposited in the bank, mm -hmm. bank are, are trading with it. Are using it to trade. <laughs> That's why the special department, uh, you know, some of them call it e currency. Mm -hmm. Some of them call it treasury. Mm -hmm. Even let me tell you, sir. Do you know your CBN? They don't even joke with this guy. They don't joke with this market. Mm. The CBN. Yeah. That's that's the power. Your government. So why, if all these folks are looking at this, so what are you going to say about yourself? See there mm. looking at say, man, it doesn't work. It works. The next gold mine, and it has always been the gold mine. All you need to look at is that you need to look at how can I be part of it? So tap from this gold, you need a skill. Maybe with the help of a good platform, yeah. that's where you can actually sit and say, can I sacrifice? Because I can tell people, I say, you have to also look at what you will be willing to give. Can I sacrifice this time to be able to learn mm -hmm. uh, this, this skill on how to tap from this gold? How to how to dig the the, the mine, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so digging the mine that you need a skill. So it's the next gold mine, or it has been the gold mine. All you need to do is that to look at how to be part of it, and you don't need to do too much. When you get the right skill set, maybe with the help of a good platform, yeah, then you will consistently consistently be digging inside that gold. I can tell you mm -hmm. that's what it is. So guys, uh, listening to me, there is nothing as rewarding easily cheaply uh in short i i had this uh this man you know one of these motivational teacher uh mr obom king you know <laughs> you know he advocated talks about it now mm. most of the people talking about forest 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 i mean these are people that never thought about you know being part of forest right now everybody's talking about forest mm -hmm. guys so you have to look at how to you know you know get yourself fitting Settled in into this market why still you're still keeping that your job yeah. because that job that you so dedicated that time you know it is not your job i hope you know mm. one day if you don't retire the job will retire you you retire so, yes so retire, now what you start chasing another job you know there's nothing wrong in chasing another job mm -hmm. but how about you just having time you want to spend time with your family 
you want to spend time with yourself, you want to be, say, have a nice vacation, mm -hmm. you want to be able to say, there you go. Let, let me even tell you why it's another good Another point here is that, do you know that you can travel to anywhere in the world uh, with just internet, your smartphone, or maybe your computer by your side, mm -hmm. you are making money without even disturbing any, any. Mm. Uh, okay, let me blow your bubbles. You know, there was a time I was in, I went for a training in Ghana mm -hmm. to train some folk. Uh, the hotel I was staying is about a couple of hundred dollars per night. Mm -hmm. uh, myself and my partner were in that hotel. And, uh, you know, the, the hotel, we were making the money of that room in that hotel. Mm. Everything. We we're making it. We we're making it. So I, 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 we just sleeping. It's like we are sleeping in the room for free. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and we are having. So so it, it, it's that sweet and that robust. So you can actually do that. Nobody mm. can do that. So mm. and that is why you know, anywhere, in as much as you have internet, you have your smartphone. Yeah. And like I said, you don't even need to be smart to use a smartphone. True okay? that. So, uh, True that. Internet, you have phone then you are well on the go. I'm telling you, anywhere, any day, you don't need to break the bank. You don't need to disturb anybody's life. You'll be in your own. I mean, you see folks in the U.S. now, most of Nigerians in the U.S., I see them, what they're doing online. Uh, it's about people living their normal, regular, 9 to 5 trade mm -hmm. for us. In the U.S., I see folks, again, Nigerians, mm -hmm. you know, living their regular job. You know, I, I'm so surprised. My sister, you know, she was telling me, somebody that, you know, she knows I do this, and she said, She's looking at, you know, also doing it for us. She lives in the UK. And I'm saying, okay, okay, I think you are bringing it now. Something is pushing him. Yeah. So where is she learning that? This is somebody that I knew that, okay, she will never be part of anything when it comes to online because of her background. She's in the medical plan. So, oh. and right now she's saying that way forward. Oh, so, uh, you know, I believe uh, people need to start looking at it. Uh, mm. And I think it's high time. They mm. look, it's $6.6 trillion. No be joke at all. Our daily money be that. At though. all. Our current <laughs> money be that. <laughs> all right. Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Afolabi, for this uh, conversation. It's quite insightful. I believe, say, people will watch and they're going to say, okay, oh, it's high time they tap into this industry, seeing the fact that now here the money day, per day, see the kind of money with the thing they bring out. So everybody has uh, uh, the ability to also be part of it. And thank you for your tips on how people can get involved and uh, what they, they need to do. It's been an amazing conversation. Thank you very much, Mr. Falabi, for your time. Thank you so much. It's All my right. pleasure. All Always. right. All right. Uh, we just finished the conversation with uh, Mr. Falabi Olatunji in uh, uh, um, business development coach for Forex and cryptocurrency trading. But it was quite an insightful conversation. And I believe say, for those of now we don't know as this thing may be, we've just given you the opportunity to, you know, to see through it and see how you can tap into that industry based on saying that the new you know, uh, gold mine as the talker. Okay.